You are already dead. So I can sort this out later. Good morning, evening, whatever. We are, uh, I'm gonna create a character. Why is my, uh, oh, I don't know. Uh, no, a normal character. And then we're gonna boost him. Sith, obviously. Right. Sith Sorcerer, Sith Juggernaut, Sith Marauder. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think we have a sorcerer anymore, do we? Abilities, uh, advanced classes, yeah. Uh, so corruption, lightning, or madness? Hmm. I mean, we do have a light, a class. I don't think we do, do we? Do we not? No, we had a Oh, we have a... Hmm. We could, we could do you up, actually, couldn't we? Um... No, we don't have to play, uh, do anything then, do we? We could just go and continue it. That's... Oh, although, do we want to just start from the start? I think we just want to start from the start, don't we, really? Um... Yeah, let's just start from the start, I think, will be the best thing for it. Um, Alright, let's get rid of this guy. Let's go with Thorthra, as lightning is pretty friggin' cool. Um, get rid of that, okay. Um, we'll probably do the Marauder at some point as well. Oh wow, I've got all of this, have I? Um, I kind of liked it then, but no. We'll go with Twelik. Why not? Twelik. Why not? Cool. Um, I don't know. I kind of want to go with male. That's somewhat intriguing. Because I want to woo vet, as you can. I can't. I can't do all these. Oh, you have to be a legacy. Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> no, no. Um, we'll keep the body type. We we'll keep the head. Uh, that die will do. Uh, the colour for a start, I want to be blue. Yeah, and then just randomise this all the stuff. Uh, I kind of like that one. Uh, we'll go with that one. I quite like that. Yeah. So bad, was it? Cool. And let's put the complexion down to nothing. Make him look young. That's a bit too young. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, yeah, we'll keep the name Reeves. Reeves McTush. McTush, that's incorrect. That's incorrect. Okay, so. Uh, is everything we want? We, she, it's. You're a sorcerer, I assume. I'm fairly sure. Sorcerer, yeah, Twilek. Reeves, cool, stop playing. I should probably be um, reading this, shouldn't I? The power of the dark side grows. The Sith Empire has won a major victory against the Galactic Republic and its Jedi Guardians, conquering and slaving seven million new worlds. With the fragile peace in place, the Empire sends its slave to the ancient Sith stronghold of Karaban, hoping to unearth the relics of the past power that can be used to dominate the galaxy. One slave, powerful with a force, has been released from the servitude and forced to master the dark arts of the Sith or die, trying. 
Also, I just realised that vet is a Sequoia thing rather than a uh, <laughs> a normal, so we'll have to not have that then. All right, let's get rid of that. Okay, base part continue. This should do. Twenty-one male still. Nice. I should send some money though. That's probably imperative. I also need to sort out my UI. Oh, of course, of course, there's frame drops. Why wouldn't there be? For no reason in the slightest. <sighs> ah, the last one to arrive is finally here. I hope you don't think you're special. It would be a shame if freedom went to your head. Or if you somehow got the idea you didn't need to pass your trials to become Sith. Lord Zash has tasked me with sorting through you, Refuse, to find one worthy of being her apprentice. And I intend to do just that. Give us a chance. We can prove what ourselves. What was that? We'll just see about that. Oh. Now the rest of you gutter trash already know your trial. Get going while I bring our latecomer up to speed. Watch your back, friend. And don't worry, it'll be all right. He can't kill us all. Thanks. That means a lot coming from a beautiful girl. <laughs> You're cute. Just watch you don't get yourself killed. Spoiler alert, I'm fairly sure if you die. Now, slave, for your trial. There's a hermit named Spindrol who lives in the tomb of a Junta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Spindrol's a lunatic, but Lord Zash sees him as some kind of prophet. Once you find him, he will test you. The more challenging, the better. But there, you know your task. Spindrol lives in the tomb of a Junta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Don't keep Spindrol waiting, slave. Slave. Can't wait to kick you in the face. Right, let's go light side, because I don't... Sure, why not? Uh, okay, so there's a few things I do want to do. Key bindings. Um, okay, let's try this again. Cartel market. Hmm? Thank you. What is this? Okay, so that. You're welcome. Okay, so, um, oh, I mean, greetings. I am 2VR8, that totem droid for this vessel. You must be my new master. Gentle, kind new master. <laughs> So I get a starship and a servant, too. Not bad at all. I am relieved, uh, uh, pleased, that you find me agreeable. <laughs> I will never disappoint you, Master. I am programmed for a wide array of tasks, including but not limited to meal preparation, ship maintenance, janitorial duty, and etiquette. Welcome aboard this Fury-class Imperial Interceptor. A versatile craft combining a starfighter's maneuverability with armament to rival larger military vessels. You'll find all of the standard amenities, including your own private captain's locker for storing valuables. The astrogation console contains a constantly updated map of the known galaxy. Interstellar communications are accessed via the ship's holo terminal. Priority alerts that you may find useful are available from the Imperial Holonet console. Lastly, the ship's intercom will inform your crew that you wish to issue new orders. Any questions, Master? Cool. Excellent. Uh... I have a mission to complete. Time to see what this ship can do. Thank goodness you aren't deactivating me. I mean, good luck. I regret I am unable to offer you combat support, Master. 
Frankly, my chassis couldn't withstand the stress. However, should any errands arise that are beneath your superior status, please do not hesitate to call upon me. I function to serve you. Whenever you are ready to depart, consult the galaxy map on your bridge. It will program the proper astrogation coordinates and activate the engines. Almost seems useless to have a pilot, really, doesn't it? But there we are. All right. Man rank up two? I don't know what that means, but sure. Master Stage Crown with the emergency, you'll get you selected to the next level, be sure to select your discipline if you haven't. And you're going to turn appropriate to a class and different person you're now, a person journey, aid you in your journey, if you don't know, if you're in the next level, you can tie all your personal ships to the map. Okay, cool. Thanks. Alright, so, for a start, command crate? Open. Uh, okay. I didn't really know what that did, but... Cool, I guess? Claim? Oh, nice, okay. Alright, okay. Uh, don't really know what this does, but call cool anyway. Uh, was that the right click to use item? Cool, alright. Um, let's move that down there for the time being. Well, let's put that on. Are these stuff you can. Can you sell these? Buy any quip? I can apparently, cool. Well, let's, uh, let's give myself these vehicles. And we will uh, we'll sell these, I think. Bound to legacy. Okay. And then equip. Uh, we could probably sell these. Bound to legacy, okay. I mean, I could probably put those in the the auction house, couldn't you? Uh, that's stuff I can probably sell as well. Okay, cool. I don't really know what command crates do, but that's cool nonetheless. Right, let's just have a look at our log. Yeah, still got this to do. Excellent. I'm happy at that. Uh, it doesn't doesn't do it. It doesn't do that either. Nice. Combat efficiency is lightning. Commit. All right. Uh, uh, increased damage reduction by 3%, increased damage to my full storm, yep. Uh, reduced damage damage for whirlwind, dark heal, so just increased damage reduction, that'll do. And suppression, which can... Uh, mm -hmm. Any effects? Uh, those are good items, but you keep back 10 seconds, just send your target, okay. You're static by cross energy, attacking attackers, is there, let's make you... Oh, so that's... Hmm, okay. Sure. Ah, uh, I don't know, I guess. Okay, so I didn't choose this. Is, okay, well, I should probably check online, shouldn't I? Um, Sith Sorcerer 70 uh, build. Uh, right, so. Yeah, that's great. I just want to know the useful skills. Master. Oh. In the PV can I take on every fight, so spirit, that, and immersion. Okay. Okay, legendary. So we get two of these. Force mobility. Cool. And Unnatural vigor. Hmm, cool, okay. Commit. Alright, uh, let us <laughs> put some of this down now, because I need to sort out my inventory. Um, not my inventory, sorry, my stuff here. <laughs> nice. You could have a family tree, that's cool. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, oh, we only have that? Hmm. We should probably go and grab some crew, shouldn't we? Hmm. Okay. There's priority stuff I'm not bothered about. 
Did you require anything, Master? A hot meal, perhaps? Conversation? Uh, to myself. Just say the word. Carbon. Robert Carbon. Why can I not try to Carbon? That was in my current time. Oh, okay. We're literally at Carbon now. All I have to do is go back. I hope this uh, puts me down. And we're not just going to be unbelievably powerful. <clears throat> right, so Thundering Blast is a devastating wave that we should use always. That's an Okay. That's that. Four storm. Cool. Okay. It's kind of fun, it's like, you slave, no, really? Am I though? <laughs> ha, here we are. Alright, okay, let's head to the Valley of the Dark Lords. Oh, I'd probably get Levick Legacy experience as well, wouldn't I? Yes, I would do, excellent. Command XP. Okay. Mm hmm. Does kind of look like we're going to swamp these guys. Mm hmm. Disappointed it's not put me down, to be honest. We're just going to be able to fly through this entirely, but alright, fair enough. And another colour crystal in, okay. Let's put this one in then. New veteran? Probably not. Spindrel! Ah, an alien acolyte. Unusual, but not unexpected. The Sith are not friendly to your kind. But that will be an advantage, I think. You are here for your trial, yes? Mm -hmm. Learn the ways of the Sith from a doddering old man in a tomb. Uh -huh. And hopefully to return to your master with the mark of my approval. I guess so. Yes, my lord. That's right. Of course it is. I know the way of things on the surface. But before I answer either way, you must pass a trial of blood. Survive. And I will teach you what I know. <laughs> well... <laughs> These guys are just not going to survive.
Well, that was easy. Oh, I am. Yeah, it is shifting me down. Excellent. Cool. Excellent. These former acolytes wanted nothing more than to earn their second chance for glory by killing you and taking your place. But your desire proved stronger, and their blood became the mantle of your victory. Well done. But you are not Sith yet. Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, power. Through power, victory. Through victory, my chains are broken. This is the Sith Code. Commit it to your heart, and you will have the strength to crush your enemies. Do you understand? Of course. I was born to be Sith. Good. Then go. Return to Harkon and nurture your hatred for him. And use your fear of him to grow stronger. He may raise his fist to strike, but it is Lord Zash who determines where the blow will land. But who controls Zash, I wonder? When you know hmm. the answer to that, you will have power over both your masters. Now, go. Leave me to my rest. Leave me to my rest. I'm fairly sure we can easily just come back up. Oh. Alright, maybe not. Okay, whatever. 